Stress incontinence is involuntary passage of urine because of increased intra-abdominal pressure like coughing or sneezing. Junction of the bladder and the urethra is known as the bladder neck and it is maintained at an angle known as the urethrobesical angle. This angle is maintained by the strong pelvic floor muscles. Normally, when there is increased intra-abdominal pressure, it closes the bladder neck, therefore preventing the leakage of urine. But when there is bladder neck descent or urethral hypermobility, then the abdominal pressure is not able to close the bladder neck, leading to urine incontinence. Therefore, the aim of treatment is to strengthen the pelvic floor muscles by Kegel exercises or by surgeries which restore the urethrovesical angle. Surgeries can be pelvic surgeries where the paravaginal fascia is attached to the Cooper's ligament known as the Birch Corpus suspension. This remains to be the treatment of choice in stress incontinence or the paravaginal fascia is attached to the pubic bone known as the MMQ procedures. Then there are sling surgeries where a polypropylene mesh is passed around the neck of the bladder to maintain the UV angle. If it is done through the vagina, it is known as transvaginal taping. If it is done through the obturator foramen, it is known as transobturator taping. There are a lot of complications with the sling surgeries like urinary retention and infection. Therefore, Birch Corpus suspension continues to be the treatment of choice. For non-invasive procedures, there are also bulking agents which are injected into the urethra so that they don't open up easily.